Today in the new Pet Simulator 99 update, there are a lot of very easy huge pets to get. So let's talk about all the very easy huge pets to get so you could get your first huge pet right now and very easily. So first off in this new update, there was a new way to get a huge pet, which was in World 2. Yes, you have to at least have World 2 and a lot of these areas unlocked because if you get one of the secret keys, you can actually unlock a secret area where you could get a huge pet. And that's right over here in area 159, I believe. Yeah, 159. And in this area, you have a treasure hideout. And you need this special key, the treasure hideout key, which costs 4 million gems if you want to get it. Uh, like, buy it. Or if you want to get it yourself, then you can get it in pieces or the entire key from random drops. And as you guys see right here, you have a chance to get a huge electric cat. And if we go all the way back to the spawn, we go check the pet index and how many exist based on how long this update has came out for. So if you go to the index right here and search up huge electric cat just like this and the huge electric cat alone dude already has been one day only and has 13.3k exists dude so one day it got 13,000 of these huge pets that is very common i guess you could say to get this huge pet and the wrap on it is 60 million so if you do want to get it for yourself i mean you get 30 minutes from that one key that you could easily get in the trading plaza or you could just get it yourself by drops but if you're too lazy like how i am sometimes i'm waiting for it then you could just go to trading plaza and then buy it for yourself the only thing is when you're buying it you're risking it because you're spending gems to get it and then let's say you're super unlucky like how i usually am and eventually let's say you do spend 60 million uh in total on keys and you don't get it well you could have just bought the huge pet itself so this guy's selling it for 4.15 million i'll go ahead and buy one right now i'm probably not gonna do the entire 30 minutes since i'm recording this video but i'll show you guys how it is all right so i'm back in this area now we could go to area 159 right over here and i'll show you guys so you get an entire 30 minutes of doing whatever you want want in here so make sure when you get in you have all your best pets equipped make sure you got all your fruits everything that you need to get all your damage because you're going to be constantly breaking uh all the items and all the breakables in order to have a chance to get it so i usually just use all of the fruits i have get all my best potions damage potions everything on and once i have all that on i could just enter this right over here and then as you guys see it, it will unlock for 30 minutes just like that and there we go we just entered in and boom get your pets over here as fast as you can because now when we reach the break goal which is 3000 it will give an increased drop rate so it's going to be boosted so you'll have better chances at getting it and yeah as you guys see i'm getting a whole lot of drops so you're always getting something at least so that's a good thing but you could just do this for literally 30 minutes so that's a very long time that's why i'd say make sure you have like all your enchants probably go empower them if you can if not then just work with what you got but i would for sure get all of these fruits equipped because i know that they're very cheap and they do make a difference you can't put any flags or use tnt or anything like that so that does suck but you could still have a pretty good chance of getting this huge bet so you know what let's forget about this right now because i'm still recording this video and i mean the key is not that expensive it's only like four million so i'll worry about that later but a lot of things people are forgetting is in world one so let me talk about world one and the huge pets there because a lot of you guys are forgetting this now everyone right now is in world two and you're it, it, it makes sense to focus on everything in world two but if you just want a huge pet and you don't even have one and you just want any type of huge pet doesn't matter which i mean world one still has pretty good options and also you could still do the mini games here uh to have a chance to get a huge pet so there's a lot of different ways to get huge pets here uh first one being right over here there is a fishing spot actually i think i might have passed it all right so obviously you guys know i don't remember this that much because i barely uh play in world one but anyway there's a fishing site right over here huge Poseidon and quirky it has uh gotten a lot easier than what it was before but yeah i don't think I, they changed any of the chances in this update but in case you guys do want to you could try Try fishing over here leave an auto clicker on an auto grinder anything like that usually a lot of people use 
uh, the macros on this, so you guys could do that and try to get a huge pet for yourself. There is that, but I think the easiest one now is actually Chest Rush, and Chest Rush is somewhere else. There is Dig Site, by the way. Let me show you guys Dig Site first. Chest Rush is in Area 45, but Dig Site is uh, over here somewhere. It should be like right over here by the pyramids. Yeah, Area 30 right over here. There is a Fossil Dragon. This one is actually a, a bit difficult, but there is this fossil dragon over here now those two the digging and fishing are two mini games where it's like infinitely you could just keep trying now the one that you can't infinitely keep trying is a chest rush and there's a cooldown every time you do it so i mean if you guys are literally doing nothing in the game and you have some free time and you're bored for sure go to chest rush and try to get this huge fire horse because there's so many of these that exist there's already 2.7k and that's from people not even doing this chest rush because whenever I, I see people trying to get huge pets no one ever tries chest rush number one because they always forget about it number two it's in world one no one really wants to try to get it number three i don't think this huge pet has that much demand so no one really cares about this huge pet but if you want to just try to get a huge pet i recommend just do this because it's kind of just like that area that I showed you guys the secret hideout because as you guys see it's pretty much just like this it just drops random loot and then you have a small chance on getting the huge fire horse it may not be as easy as a huge electric cat but it's the exact same thing and you can break a lot more of the breakables so you do have a decent chance of getting it based on how fast you could break all this so there's that and this actually lasts depending on how fast you break all the other big chests you can stay in this area for literally a good four to four and a half minutes to get that huge pet there's a lot of other ways like in this area right here in area three the castle there's the crystal chest where you have a small chance of getting this huge pet by using your crystal key and crystal keys are pretty much free bro they are just so cheap but it's a very small chance on getting the huge pet i believe it's a one in 25k i may be wrong about that though but you guys could check on that anyway there's that and then there's a spinning wheel right here which is a 0.1 percent chance to get but it's only when the huge pet pops up here and if the huge pet does not pop up there and you want to get always a chance of getting a huge pet there without um spinning the wheel you can just rejoin the game and the wheel will reset so you can keep rejoining the game till the wheel resets to show the huge pet here and every time it shows it that's when you spin it so for example right now i would not spin the wheel i would rejoin and then i would spin the wheel and then that like guarantees you a chance of every time you have a 0.1 percent chance to get a huge pet so in case you guys want to play it like that you guys can there's a lot of ways and there was a lot more huge pets you could get in world 2 and also in this update that I haven't even mentioned and there's probably some stuff that I, I also missed so if I did miss anything let me know in the comments and if you guys are looking for other ways make sure you check the comments because maybe someone mentioned something that I forgot about or something like that so anyway over here you got a tech chest over here as well and it's the same thing I actually got a huge cyber agony and there's 22,000 of these things that exist almost 23,000 tech keys are also pretty cheap not as cheap as the crystal keys but still pretty cheap and i'm pretty sure the chances are the same on getting this pet as well so yeah just get a ton of tech keys you could also get these from drops so if you do have them from drops it's either you sell them or open them up i would say just open them up because they don't even sell for that much anyway so i mean open them up and if you get lucky you get a huge pet if you don't then it's whatever and then as for this i don't think there's a huge pet you get from here because i've never seen it so i don't think you get a huge pet from this spinny wheel because i never seen it here so it's just random that's why the tickets have literally no value no one really cares about it the only things that have value is things that give huge pets like literally that's what i've been noticing so there's that and now let's go to the update log and show you guys all the other stuff that was in this update that I probably missed. So as you guys see right over here, it says new huge pets and there's all of these huge pets and it says exactly how to get each and every single one. So the huge party dragon is found in the hype egg every update. So you guys know that one, the hype egg, that one's new. Um, the huge electric cat, I showed you guys, but I'll show you guys a huge party dragon. And then the huge pixel shark, that's rewarded in the 2024 pixel clan battle. That's a clan battle thing with which it's usually just the same clans winning. Um, and then we got the huge tech samurai cat. 
that's found in the clan gift. And then we got a huge uh, sketch dragon, that's a sketch egg, huge sketch corgi, sketch egg, and then the huge lunar moth, which is the global event gift. Alright, so now let's go back in the game. And you guys saw some of those things. I mean, let me go show you guys one of them. And that's the hype gifts. The hype eggs, actually. Here they are right here. The wrap has been dropping on these. It's 1.69 million now. And it's pretty much, you open it up just like this. It's not really an egg. It's kind of like a gift, the animation. And it just gives you random stuff. And you have a crazy small chance of getting the huge pack. As you guys see, I got total junk. Like, literally nothing. It's better off me selling the egg than opening it sometimes. So there's that okay and then also for all those different quests we do have all that over here wherever it is i gotta find it again because i keep getting mixed up with all this here it is right over here the global events you have a chance of getting it as you guys see here's a lunar moth right over here from the global event gift and then there is the global stuff local stuff the local being server and then all these quests that you gotta complete so there's all that stuff too but yeah it all depends i feel like those are probably harder so the things that you should try aiming for is i'd say the huge electric cat dude that thing is like apparently so easy to get and i mean it makes sense there's so many that already exist so try to get as many of those secret hideout keys as you can you know what let me go there real quick has it been 30 minutes i don't even know how long i've been recording for so let's go check it out in area 159 and let's see boys oh i already closed dude and i got the cooldown ding all right so i gotta wait another five hours at 35 minutes just to do it and people say that they get it first try so i mean it's worth the shot for you guys to do it maybe you guys got better luck than me so if you guys got the gems for it probably buy for four million and if you buy for four million and then if you get the huge pet dude that's four million to 60 million so it's all about luck at that point but you guys see how some people are just selling it some people are not selling it some people are buying to try to get it so instead of buying them because you're risking four million every time you buy one i'd say try to get it from drop so go to your best area here and then once you have your best area get your best pets get your best everything out and just afk grind here okay just afk grind get all your best stuff to get all the different drops so i'd say as for flags you should go for one of these flags the exotic flags right here the treasure flags these flags are really good to get drops um make sure you have all your potions to get more drops everything like that because drops is what you need and you got to get those keys there are half keys as well so if you do have like let's say the top half key but not the bottom half key then i would say just buy the bottom half key now i actually got a treasure hideout half key the lower half and that alone is worth 744k gems so that's pretty good too all i need is the upper half key and i already got this uh, from a drop so that's pretty w so if i get an upper half i could craft it up if not then i gotta go buy it and that's how it just works and also sometimes a lot of people just put like these fortune flags over here and if there are these people that just have these flags and auto click these flags and as you guys see it's going to be staying here for an hour and 11 minutes if you guys don't want that to happen then just go to a private server i'd say and yeah so for me i would have to leave this game go back to world one go back to world two and then i'll be in a private server um so i could do that but i'm not grinding that right now i could just buy it i mean that's what i usually do i don't really need those huge pets i already have so many huge pets so yeah that's pretty much it for this video i hope you guys enjoy like subscribe comment you already know and see you later peace